We are the Tenth Legion, exiles from a dying empire who founded the Kingdom of Ebb. For 400 years, we guided and protected our people. We gave them peace, prosperity, fair judgment. Some say it was the death of the old king that turned the people against us. But it was Jane Cassinder who took up the sword and drove us from our chapter houses and estates. I was not there for the final battle when the last of our legion faced Jane Cassinder beneath the boughs of an ancient, hallowed tree. Nor do I know what power she called upon in that forest to murder my comrades and friends. After that, the forest was changed, twisted and ruined. Only Jane walked out of that place alive. Thirty years have passed since the Legion was destroyed, and Ebb has suffered in that time. War rages without end between Jane Cassinder in the east and the royal family in the west. A few sons and daughters of the Legion remain. You are one of their number. I write to you, my young friend, with urgent news. I have always believed that you are special. Ever since I found you as a child at the edge of the forest where the Legion died. If you are truly an Archon, a creature of legend as you seem to be, then you are a sign of hope to me. And it's no accident that you fell into my care. As the last survivor of the Legion, I've tried my best to keep you safe and to teach you the ways of your kind. But Jane Cassinder still hunts for the sons and daughters of the Legion and for all those we hold dear. Now I fear that her spies may be getting close. We cannot delay any longer. We still have a chance to join together rebuild the Legion, and take our country back from Jane Cassinder before it's too late. The sons and daughters of the Legion are gathering in the north at the old Mont Baron estate. I urge you to join us in the Valley of Rukenval as quickly as you can. Help us restore all that was lost. Your faithful friend, Odo. Seems we have another rat trying to escape the trap.
here. I was afraid everyone else was dead. Are you all right? I'm fine. But who are you? Have we met? No. But Odo's told me stories about you. The warrior maid who fights with a spear. My name is Martin Giescard, and I'm a friend of Odo's, and a son of the Legion. I didn't see Odo upstairs. Could he still be alive? I hope so. If he did get out, maybe some of the others are with him. Damn, they found us again. We can't wait any longer. I've set a trap. Three kegs of gunpowder on the bridge below. Thought I'd cover my escape if they found me. All we need to do is light the fuses. Come on, to the bridge. Go on, light the fuses. Two more to light. Hurry. And the last. Trap is sprung. Cover your ears. The Mount Baron estate burned, and with it my dream of a reborn Tenth Legion. Or so I thought. I did not know that you and Martin Giscard had escaped the destruction. As you fled into the night, you bore with you the future of the Legion. Pursued by enemies, fleeing toward an uncertain fate, you made your way across the empty leagues of the Rukenval. Throughout the journey, you were driven by a single hope, that others had survived the devastation and that they reached the safety of the Rukenval chapter house. It was a slender hope, to be sure, but even a small hope can warm a man in the cold dark of night. As long as you drew breath, the Tenth Legion yet lived, but your foes pressed close about, hunting you. The fate of the Legion, the fate of Ebb itself, rested with you. I know this part of the valley. We've come a long way. I think we're close to the old Legion chapter house. If any of our friends is still alive, that's where they'll be. Tell me about the attack. What do you remember? Odo sent letters to all the descendants of the Legion. 
He wanted to gather them here, train them as legionnaires, and take back the country. Most had already arrived when the mercenaries found us. They surrounded the estate, must have killed the men who were on watch. They smashed through the windows and the doors, slaughtered everyone they could find. Then they set fire to the house. How many people were in the estate when you were attacked? Almost 40. All sons and daughters of the Legion. Some of them had fought in the wars, but the rest, they were no match for those soldiers. We can hope that a few survived, but most of them are dead. Our enemies didn't seem interested in prisoners. Did you see what happened to Odo? No. I lost sight of him when the fire started. But we agreed to meet at the old chapter house if anything went wrong. Those mercenary soldiers, have you fought them before? They were less Kanzi, I think. A wandering people, from the desert in the north. I have no idea who sent them here. Les Kanzi will fight for anyone who pays them. No, our real enemy hasn't shown himself. Or herself. Not yet. That's enough about the attack for now. Right. Maybe Odo can- I've never been here before. Does this valley have a name? They call it the Rukenval. It's hard country. Not easy to control, even with an army. That's why Odo chose this place. He thought we'd be safe here, while we trained a new legion. Were the Mott Barons the only legion family in the valley? No. The Gundricks had a manor here too. They were an old family, and they were here long before the Mont Barons. Stefan Gundrick didn't stand with the legion at the end. I never heard what happened to him or his family. You said this is hard country. Are there any dangers I should know about? Spiders. They're as large as a man, and they're smart. They'll ambush travelers on the road. And there's worse things in the forest. Have you heard of the Dakenware? The Beast Lords? In other parts of Ebb, they're only stories. Out here, believe me, they're all too real. How many people live out here? Only a few. There's a village, Raven's Rill. Most of the people are hunters and trappers, from all I've heard. Pilgrims and merchants used to come here before the Legion fell, made the town rich. But that was years ago, when the roads were still safe. Thank you. That's all I need to know about the valley. Sorry I couldn't tell you more. I've only been here for a few weeks myself. The Legion had a chapter house here? In this valley? They built chapter houses in every part of Ebb, even in remote places like this. There were strongholds where legionnaires would meet, sometimes in fellowship, sometimes for war. You should have seen the Grand Chapter House in Stonebridge, headquarters for the whole legion. My father took me inside it once. Let's keep moving. We can talk more later. You're right. The Chapter House isn't far. Follow me. If our enemies knew we were at the estate, they may have guessed that we'd make a run for the chapter house. No help for it, though. That's where we agreed to meet. We'll have to stay sharp. They could come for us anywhere. At any time. Less Kanzi by the look of it. Can't be a coincidence. Let's look around. We might find out what they're planning. <laughs> so 
So, there's a bounty on our heads. That means they know we're alive, and they're still hunting for us. There it is. The bridge to the chapter house. 